Hello everyone, welcome back again to Mufasuke channel with Briska to the modeling basic tutorial how to create a minimalist floor plan. Okay, first uh, I will create a new drawing. You can click file and you click new. Okay, in here I will use uh, default imperial uh, template and you can click open. Okay. You also can active all uh, object snap. You can right click in here. Okay, and you can click settings. Okay, in here I will change uh, for uh, auto snap in here. You can check all. Okay, and for uh, edit snap, uh, we check in here. Okay, you can check all. You can click close. Okay, first uh, I will create a line. Okay, you can create line start from this point. Okay, to the right here, uh, 15 feet. And move uh, to the top. Uh, 36 uh, feet okay I will do this point uh, 15 feet and you can tap C to close uh, this line comment okay next uh, you can use uh, copy comment we copy this uh, line object uh, to the bottom here with uh, this 10 uh, 9 feet uh, 7 inch Okay, and then I will uh, copy this line object uh, to the bottom here, 6 uh, feet. We copy again this line, uh, 7 feet. Okay, and the last uh, we copy this uh, line object uh, to the bottom here, 10 feet, and enter. Okay, I will uh, create a line object, okay, start from uh, this point into this point. And you can move uh, the last object. Okay, start from this point to the right here, 7 uh, feet, and enter. Use uh, trim command to cut uh, this uh, line object. Okay, next uh, I will use uh, join command. You can type uh, join, uh, enter, and then I will select uh, these uh, three objects to join. Okay, we join again this uh, object. Okay. Use uh, offset uh, command, you can tap offset, uh, enter, and you can give uh, offset uh, this time uh, 6 uh, inch. Okay, and then I will offset uh, this object uh, to inside here, and this object to the top. Okay, we offset with uh, offset uh, this time 1.75 inch. Okay, I will offset uh, this line object uh, to the top and then to the bottom. We offset again in here. Okay, and the last we offset. Okay, you can select uh, this uh, middle line, delete. Okay, we select again in here, delete. Use uh, trim command, okay, to cut uh, this object. Okay, we cut in here. I will cut in here. Okay, you can cut uh, one by one this uh, wall. Okay, we cut in here. And lastly, okay, I will cut in the bottom here. You can just set the comment. Okay, I will cut in here. Next, uh, we can create a line object. You can tap line, enter, start from this point into here, and move uh, the last object. Okay, to the left here, four uh, feet, and enter. Okay, use a trim command to cut uh, this line object. Okay, now I will use uh, a hedge command. You can tap hedge. Okay, hedge, uh, enter. And I will use uh, this uh, pattern. You can click a bit points. Okay, I will select uh, in here this uh, area, and then I will change scale in here into 25. Okay, you can uh, okay to apply. Okay, this uh, heads with uh, 25. I will uh, insert a uh, block into this uh, floor plan. You can tap uh, insert, enter and click browse okay i will insert for a door okay we use uh, this door and i will uh, put in here you can move uh, this object stuff from this point 
to here okay next I will use a uh, waypoint uh, frame command you can type a waypoint uh, frame you can click here and you can give a zero to hide uh, this waypoint okay we insert again okay I will insert a new uh, door I will use uh, this uh, door open okay okay I will uh, part in here we insert again a uh, new door okay we use uh, this door and I will click in here you can use a uh, mirror command to mirror uh, this object okay and next I will delete uh, in this object move uh, this object start from uh, this point <coughs> into this point okay we move again this object start from this point into this point okay now we can insert the furniture into this uh, block and we can type insert and cross uh, for a uh, block okay first uh, bedroom i will uh, insert uh, this uh, toilet seat and we insert again um, waste hole okay you can use uh, rotate command to rotate uh, this object and then you can move uh, this object uh, into this point okay i will move uh, this object to here okay we insert again okay new uh, block next uh, for bed i will use uh, this uh, bed uh, block Okay, you can uh, put in here. We insert again for a cupboard. Okay, <clears throat> and I will uh, insert in here. Okay, next uh, we insert uh, for uh, kitchen. Okay, kitchen staff. I will insert uh, this uh, black one. Okay, two. <clears throat> and the last of this uh, refrigerator okay you can use the rotate command to rotate uh, this object <coughs> and next uh, i will rotate uh, this object okay you can move uh, from this point into here and we move again this object start from this point into here okay we can create line start from this point okay to this point and click at this point <clears throat> you can move uh, this uh, refrigerator object okay and we move uh, to the top here okay next uh, we insert the new furniture block okay i will insert the sofa okay we use uh, this uh, sofa block I will insert in here and you can use a rotate command to rotate uh, this object and then use mirror to mirror uh, this object okay now we can move uh, this object to this point and move again to the bottom okay I will insert uh, television okay for stuff and this uh, block so in here you can use a rotate command to rotate uh, this object and then move uh, this object to this point okay we insert uh, the last uh, object uh, dining table okay i will use uh, this uh, dining table okay we attach in here and you can use a rotate command to rotate uh, this object Okay. Now we can use uh, M text uh, command to create text into this uh, floor plan. You can tap M text, enter, and click at this point to here. In here, I will uh, give name uh, kitchen. You can click OK. And next, uh, I will change uh, height for uh, this text in here into seven inch. And then for color, I will change into green. Okay, you 
can use a copy command to copy this object stuff from this point I will copy in here okay in here for kitchen in table okay wc and bedroom the last uh, in here a porch okay I will delete uh, this object and we change name in here into porch okay in here a uh, living room in here kitchen change into dining okay in here a uh, wc and the last bedroom okay now I will use the uh, hatch command to apply hatch in uh, this uh, area and in here okay, you can tap hatch okay, I will change pattern in here into this pattern okay and you can pick points I will click uh, this points and next I will change scales into 45 you can click ok we hatch again ok I will change angle in here into 45 degree and for big points I will click at uh, this point ok and you can click ok to close ok I will change uh, this uh, hatch color into uh, shine <coughs> and this color into uh, blue okay and for walls okay, I will select uh, this object we change into blue for walls in here I will change uh, into uh, yellow okay now we can uh, apply dimension into this uh, floor plan you can tap D to open dimension style manager Okay, I will click at this option dimension style and you can click in here standard okay you can edit uh, this uh, for uh, dimension first uh, I will change in here for uh, primary units in decimals into architectural and for precision I will change into this uh, option okay for fit uh, this okay and next uh, for uh, text color I will change into green okay in here text height uh, 7 inch and next for text offset in here uh, 4 inch okay I will copy this uh, point and next uh, for uh, for uh, lines and arrows in here I will arrow size uh, 7 inch okay arrows uh, I will change into architectural tick in here and then for a uh, color I will change into white okay in here I will change into full in here red okay in here full in here full is okay and next uh, for annotation is okay and dim brick in here I will change into form okay you can close and then you can tap uh, dim linear command to create a dimension linear okay I will create a star from this point into this point we create again in here Okay, we create the uh, dimension linear start from this point with the uh, M2P option. Okay, and you can click at uh, this point to this point. You can move into here. Okay, we create again a uh, dimension linear from uh, this point middle point into here and click at this point okay in the top uh, from this uh, corner into this corner and in here we put uh, with m2p option you can uh, okay i will click at uh, this point to this point and move uh, in here 
we cut again start from uh, middle point here into m2p option click from this point to this point and move in here okay we grab from uh, this middle point with m2p option click in here and in here move to this point next uh, from uh, this point into this point Okay, we cut from uh, this corner into here. The last I will click at this corner into top uh, corner and move uh, to this point. Okay, now you can change uh, this uh, dimension point or position to this point. We change again in here. Okay, change in here. And in bracket, uh, we can select uh, this dimension, move uh, to this point. Okay, and in here, uh, we move again from this point to here. Okay, now we already create uh, this uh, simple uh, to this cat uh, modeling with uh, brisket uh, software. If you have any question about this uh, tutorial, you can comment below this video. And see you next time in another brisket 2D modeling basic tutorial.